Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make a Jeopardy uh, template, your own Jeopardy template in, um, you know, PowerPoint 2010 or any other one. So first of all, you're going to write in your title. So I'm going to do my in Jeopardy. You're going to go to design, first of all, and you're going to pick yourself sort of uh, a template, like a design for your, uh, basically the theme for your PowerPoint. So I'm going to go ahead and um, choose uh, this one right here because it looks pretty cool. And we're going to write by, oops, by uh, Monos. We have Jeopardy. We're going to make this larger. Let's make it 72. You know what? No, I'm going to go and make it 96. And I'm going to put this one just down there. So once you've done this, what you're going to do is you're going to go to new slide and you're just going to go title slide. And whatever slide you can, you're just going to delete these ones right here. So you have a blank sort of slide. Now what you're going to do is this is sort of going to be your uh, Jeopardy um, question, not questions, but Jeopardy topics, categories, and all the boxes, where they are. So you're going to go ahead and you're going to go to insert shapes and you're going to pick in any shape you want that you want to use for um, your Jeopardy things or whatever you want. I don't know what to call them. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these arrows and I'm going to go one. And then I'm going to control C this. Control V it. It's going to be two. Control. That's going to be three. And I'm only going to do three for now. Right. And what you're going to do now is you're going to go to shapes again. You're going to take shapes for your... Um, the question boxes itself so the ones that are 100 200 and 300 so I'm gonna go ahead and pick out this rectangle right here I do that control C it one two three you know what no there it is so make sure they're all lined up Control V, Control V, and Control V again. You get you get the idea. This is exactly what you're supposed to do. I'm just showing you guys anyway. And that's it. Once you've got this, you're gonna go to your insert. And you're gonna go text box. You're gonna click right there, and you're gonna do one. Text box again, two, text box again, three. You're gonna go text box, you're gonna go 100 or 10, 200, 300. You're gonna repeat that for all the boxes there is. And uh, once, it won't take that long to do. So there it is. Now what you want to do is you want to go ahead and make a new slide and you're going to name this 1 hyphen 100 and you can do question there and you control C this and beat again put a little bit down low name this answer so exactly like that uh, you can go to, you're gonna click this box with the answer you're gonna go to animations you're gonna make sure that this is on mouse click go to whichever one you want I'm just gonna go body first level paragraphs just like that now what you want to do is you want to link this to this and how you're gonna do that is you're gonna use something in the insert um, box called hyperlink which is right here. You're going to click the 100, you're going to select it, hyperlink, place in this document, and then you're going to click the slide that says 1 100 on it, because that's that one. Okay, now that's hyperlinked. When you click it, it's going to take you to this slide. 
What you're gonna do now is you're gonna control C the slide, and you're gonna do um, eight more slides like this. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you're gonna name this, you know, two hundred. And then this is gonna be three hundred. And then this is gonna be two one hundred. This is gonna be two two hundred. This is gonna be two three hundred. I'm just gonna do all of them. This is gonna be three one hundred. Three two hundred. Three three hundred. So that's it. So once you've done all of them, you're gonna go back here. You're gonna control A, hyperlink, and then you're gonna go one two hundred, double click, control A, hyperlink, one three hundred, control A, hyperlink, two one hundred. Control A hyperlink two 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 wait yep two two hundred hyperlink three hundred hyperlink three one hundred so you get the idea that's what you have to do and then once you've done all of them and you've hyperlinked all of them you're ready to go so now if we look at it we can go into here and when we click it it's gonna take us to that page. When we click and it's going to show you as purple which is going to help you a lot if you're doing a seminar or a project or whatever if you click 300 it's going to take you to 300 now you want to be able to go back to this page from these so what you're going to do is you're going to go to shapes and you're going to do like a button um i'm just going to put question mark button it's right there it's going to you're going to click hyperlink to and you're gonna go to slide and you're just gonna click slide 2 which is the board okay alright make sure you drag it into place you're gonna control C it now if you notice you can just control V, control V, control V into every slide And now, when once we go um, here, we click I don't know three two hundred. We can click this back, and it'll take us here. Click that, click back, click that, click back. So that's it. Now all you have left to do is you have to write the questions and the answers. Um, if you want, you can download this template, and it's going to be in the description box. And um, so thank you guys for watching, and uh, I hope this helped you a lot. And I will see you in my next video. Tutorial. Peace.